Chairperson of the Christian Association of Nigeria, we can have raised concern over a high rate of women involvement in drug abuse that brings negative impacts on families and the society at large. This was made known during a one-day sensitization program organized by the women in Yula, Adamawa State's capital. According to Chairperson Women Wing Christian Association, Mrs. Henning Magani, the aim of the event is to educate women on the dangers of drug abuse and how to curtail the ugly trend, especially among women and girls. We have seen that our women and girls are into drugs. And there are so many divorces going on, which involves all the Christians and Muslims, not just one part. So we have seen it fit for us to be here to educate ourselves. You know, women, we, we are the custodian of our homes. And if we are into drugs, I don't know how that home will look like. The children will, co will copy it. So that is why we are here, to sensitize ourselves. Chairman of the occasion, Dr. Stephen Madua, who is represented by the Commissioner of Reconstruction, Rehabilitation and Resettlement, Enaida Sumba, lamented the level as free drug abuse cuts across all various sectors of the society and therefore call on all hands to be on deck in order to salvage the society from further damage. It's a task saddled on the shoulders of all and not only the law enforcers. As parents, guidance, Community leaders and peers, we all have a big stake, so let us brace up. A doctor from Federal Medical Center, Yula, Faruna Rafael, who is the guest speaker at the event, sheds more lights on the concept of drug abuse and the way forward. The issues bothering about around drug abuse and women uh, can be tied to a number of factors. It's actually multifactorial. But we realize that drug abuse is now a function of people trying to drown out their damage, either as a result of psychological trauma from a dysfunctional family or a dysfunctional society. The economic, the economic issues around Nigeria is harsh. And on top of that, people have troubles with their families. So this has pushed a lot of women into the use of drugs to help them to find support. Meanwhile, Adamawa State Governor Omar Fintri, also represented by the Deputy Governor, Mr. Crowder said, described the event as timely and also commended women for organizing it. This year workshop is very timely. The country is faced with a lot of drug abuse. Our youth are uh, into all kinds of drugs. This is dangerous train. Let us educate our girls shall not to involve themselves in taking hard drugs. It is therefore expected that the women would take the sensitization to other women in various communities in order to ensure good family values and proper upbringing of their children. Goodness, Benson. News Now Television.